Don't I look ready for the beach? Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel, it's Lex. And today's video is gonna be a vacation ready thrift haul, which I'm super excited about because I'm ready for vacations, already went on one, so some of these items definitely went to Vegas with me and a lot of them didn't because they're more of like beach attire. So I'm just gonna hop right into you guys. My clothing rack literally just fell down and I don't feel like putting it back up because I honestly like the way this space, the white area looks around me. So, sorry. All right, so before I show the two pieces that I have on, let me show you some accessories that I got from, I believe all three of these came from Goodwill. So I picked up two scarves from the Goodwill bin store. Your Goodwill bin store prices by the pound, so it's 99 cents per pound. So technically these scarves probably cost like, what, we're gonna say 30 cents because they're not a full pound. The first one that I picked up is probably my favorite. It's in this beautiful cream and like light mustard color. It's just a huge square. So you could definitely wear this and DIY it as a head scarf or as a cute little top if you would like. And of course, this would be perfect wrapped around a little tote bag. So I absolutely love this. The scarf that I picked up is in this beautiful zebra print. Yeah, this looks like zebra. And it's just a really thin, long scarf. So it's not square. It's about this wide in width and it's extremely long. So you can honestly still wear this as a top if you have like smaller breasts. Super excited about both these scarves. And then the last accessory I was super excited to find because ooh, I've been looking for a tote bag like this at the thrift store for the longest. And I feel like these tote bags right here go so fast. Like they don't sit around long at the thrift store at all. I got this from Goodwill and it was $7.99. It's this beautiful brown and cream tote bag. Look at it, isn't this perfect for the beach? When I saw this, I said, yes, you are going to Malibu with me. So I'm gonna be going to California for my birthday and on my actual birthday, I'm gonna be in Malibu. So I'm gonna be taking this puppy with me and I'm super excited to fill it up with random things that I probably honestly don't need at the beach, but you know, this just looks entirely super cute. All right, guys, so on to the actual outfits and clothing pieces. A lot of the items that I got in this vacation thrift haul can double up as cover-ups and outfits, which I absolutely love. So you can get like double the pictures if you want to like, you know, slay on the gram. I'm really trying to be active on Instagram. It's just so tough. Like Instagram is probably my least favorite social media. I feel like it can easily, you know, mess with your head. But I really do enjoy taking pictures and I have too many pictures and actually don't do anything with them so I'm gonna be more active on Instagram for sure so the first top that I have on is just a DIY uh, front tie top this is just a cardigan you guys that I just simply tied up in the front instead of buttoning it up I love how it has this lace detailing around the trim of it and how the sleeves are frilly at the end so it's just super cute and feminine this top would originally cost $4.49 but I got it for half off you guys so I'm super excited about this and paired with it I found a skirt you guys from Goodwill I took this to Vegas with me but I didn't actually wear it I didn't think I was going to wear it, but I just took it because I just absolutely love this skirt. It's a knee-length knitted skirt. The color of the skirt and cardigan are more of a cream. I know it's picking up more of a white ivory on camera, but it's definitely cream. I love how both these pieces can be paired together or separate. Both of these pieces are super airy and breathable, so you can definitely take these to the beach because I feel like it gets cooler at night and in the evening on beaches. You could definitely bring both these pieces and throw them over your bikini or swimsuit. And this skirt was originally $4.49 from Goodwill, you guys, and I got it for half off too, so yes. All right, guys, so these next two pieces are honestly a wrinkled mess, but no worries, when I wear them out, I'll definitely steam them. The top is this beautiful white wrap top. How cute is this and feminine and girly? I absolutely love it. And I got this top at Goodwill, you guys, for 99 cents. Found it in the large section, a brand I'm not familiar with at all. I've never really heard of it, but this top reminds me of something that I feel like you would find at like American Eagle for like $30. And I have it paired with these olive shorts, you guys, that are from H&M, and this is what they look like. Extremely comfortable and breathable, not suffocating at all. And I just have them um, rolled up once, rolled down, hits a little bit lower. And I took these to Vegas with me too and got a great little outfit out of them. I love the way these two pieces look paired together. I feel like it's a really cute spring summer outfit. And the shorts were originally $4.49, you guys. And I wanna say I actually paid full price for these shorts. I have a hard time finding shorts like this that aren't too short. I honestly need to go to Old Navy because I feel like Old Navy has great length shorts. And plus I have an Old Navy gift card, so why not? 
this top is another top that would be perfect to throw over your bikini top it'll definitely get wet because it's like more of a linen material but super easy just to wrap around and be covered so yes here are these two pieces All right, you guys, so this next outfit is probably one of my favorites because it gives me 70s vibe, and which is probably one of my favorite eras when it comes to fashion outside of, you know, early 2000s. I think because of the end of the sleeves on this top, super pretty. So the top is in this beautiful light yellow and it has a paisley print on it that has blue and some reds in it. And this top would originally cost $4.49 from Goodwill, but I got it for half off. And this is just a buttoned up uh, Liz Claiborne top you guys so I'm not cutting this at all because I feel like this is going to hold up extremely well if I ever do decide to wear it just as is and the material on this top is super breathable and thin so it's perfect for beach and I have it paired with some palazzo pants that I found from Goodwill too I'm super excited every time I find pants like this at Goodwill I will fight over them I will I'm sorry ladies I will fight you over them here are what the bottoms look like now do you guys see what I was saying when I said that this is definitely a 70s vibe because just look at it, the sleeves, look at the pants. I got these bottoms for $3. They were half off, so that's what the price came out to be. Absolutely love this outfit. It's definitely one of my favorites. Here it is. I literally just took a whole Marvin Gaye break, y'all. I'm not even kidding, y'all. Okay, but I wanted to show you guys what this top topped this top looked like without being tied like a front top super pretty still i feel like this tucked inside some jeans looks super cute or if you want to be more modest and just have it buttoned and then tie it off tie it like this at the end you can still extremely cute all right on to the next two pieces so this top you guys this top screams tropical vacation to me it looks like it came from a hawaii gift shop for sure i can't remember if i found this top in the men's or women's section you guys i feel like i found it in the women's section but it just reminds me of a men's top because of the length of the sleeves but i actually like the length of the sleeves because it reminds me of an actual front tie top i feel like usually front tie tops kind of flare out and the sleeves are a little bit longer than cape sleeves so I did the same thing with this top that I did with the one before, tucked in the collar, folded in where the buttons are, and just tied it up in the front. I found this top at Goodwill and it would originally cost $4.49 but I got it for half off. And the print on this top is just really beautiful. It's a black top with taupe and maroon flowers and it actually has some brown in there too. And these bottoms are literally, they probably are swimsuit cover bottoms, you guys. No pockets, they're like the crinkle material. And I got these from a place called Music City Thrift here in Nashville. And they would originally cost $4.98, but that day the white tags, I believe, were either 30% off or 50% off. I absolutely love these bottoms. They're extremely flowy and breathable. And they have this little cute little tie detailing. It doesn't actually cinch in the waist, but I love how the ties have the cute little beads at the bottom. Definitely taking these with me to California to throw over some of my bikinis. I know that these would be perfect for that. Here is this little outfit, you guys. Okay, you guys, so moving right along, I found two dresses that I'm extremely excited about because I feel like it's very hard finding nice dresses at Goodwill because girls be throwing them bows for them. They don't play. So the first one I found is so on trend right now and super easy just to throw on over a bikini. It is a ribbed tank mini dress and it's by the brand Express. It's white and it's razor back, you guys. I love razor back. And it's not too tight, which I absolutely love because I feel like a tight dress like this during the summer and springtime, you can easily get, you know, that boob sweat. So I didn't want it to be too tight. So I love the way this fits. Hits me about mid thigh. I am in love with this dress, you guys. What do you think? I love it. And this dress would have been $4.49. I got it for half off. So I got this beautiful tank dress for $2 and some change. Not mad at it at all. All right, guys, so this is the second dress, and this is another item that I would have fought y'all for. Look at this. How pretty is this? Oh, my gosh. So it is this halter, crinkled, black, maxi dress, plunging neckline, and the back is out. I love backless items. 
and then it has this split you guys on the left side I'm honestly shocked that I found this at Goodwill it was originally called $4.49 but I got it for half off how pretty is this you guys I absolutely love this and this dress is by the brand Lulu. This is an item I probably just would not throw away because I feel like it's easily timeless. This would be really cute if you're going to like a beach dinner on a resort. It's truly just a bomb dress for the summer too, so. All right guys, so the next couple of items I'm gonna show you are swim items. So I'm super excited that I found these goodies at the thrift store. I even found some swimsuits and bikinis. Well, one bikini and then a swim top. So starting off with this swimsuit, you guys, I found this swimsuit at Music City Thrift and it was, I believe, $5.89? Does it say $5.89? Y'all can't read that. They write it on there with a pencil. So I wanna say the swimsuit was $5.89. Paid full price for it. it wasn't half off because hello let's look at it I'm really shocked that I like this swimsuit because of the color of it this is my favorite color I love turquoise blue favorite color I feel like it's so peaceful and just reminds me of so many different things but the weird thing with me is I never liked the color turquoise in clothing until recently so when I found this swimsuit and tried it on I was like I can't believe I actually like turquoise and then I'm wearing it like I'm really about to wear it so I love the way this color looks on my skin I feel like it just pops what I'm really excited about you guys are these bottoms oh my god you know how hard it is for me to find family friendly children friendly swimsuits that actually fit me I'm upset because I feel like this company is going to be extremely hard to find. The company of this swimsuit is called Bare Assets. You get it? The bottoms are in like a boy shortcut, which I absolutely love. But then the sides, but on the sides of them, they have the um, cinching detailing to where you can tighten it or make it longer. They cover my behind fully, you guys. It's like a little cheeky to have the bottom left out, but you know, nobody's worried about that. I'm so happy that I found this swimsuit for $5. Like, oh, look at it. I love it and I really really do enjoy this color. I can't believe I waited this long to actually try on a turquoise item. I think what it was is I feel like turquoise in certain fabrics and materials just looks cheap to me. So maybe that's what so it was. The next swim item I got is this swimsuit top right here you guys and I got this from the Google bin. So understand I scrubbed the crap out of it. I definitely suggest hand washing and machine washing your swimsuits if you thrift them. Just, you know, get in there real good with your hands. Just don't put them in the machine. Just, you know, for sanitary reasons. So I found this at the Goodwill bin and they do their pricing 99 cents per pound. So this top costs less than a dollar. It has like a floral Aztec print going on. I love the colors of it. The earth tones just are beautiful to me. And the tie, I love this right here. This, I feel like makes the top, honestly. And I've actually already worn this top, you guys. I have a picture on Instagram with it. So if you want to see what this top looks like paired with some black bikini bottoms, just go on my Instagram, like the picture while you're at it. I don't have many printed swimsuits now that I think about it, so I'm super excited that I thrifted two that I absolutely love. It's not like, huh, they're cute. I really actually enjoy both of them, and I know I'm going to get plenty wear out of them. Hey guys, so the last two items that I thrifted are swimsuit cover-ups, and I'm super excited about them because I feel like these double as like cute little dresses if you want to take another picture for the gram. And I'm really happy that I found these swim cover-ups because I have a hard time spending $30 on these type of swimsuit cover-ups. That's the reason why I don't have any like this. So I actually really needed some like this. The first one is in this beautiful orange. It has crochet detailing going up the sleeves and down the center of it with these little rope strings that you can tie up in the front. And I love how this is long sleeve and hits at a perfect length for your knee. It has two splits coming up on the sides of it. And I really needed swimsuit cover-ups like these that are not like mesh or see-through because when I step inside buildings after swimming, I'm freezing cold because they have the AC on because it's the summertime. But I'm cold nature, so I'm always cold. So the mesh swimsuit cover-ups, they don't give me no type of warmth when we go back inside buildings. So instead, I will throw this on if I know I'm going inside an establishment. So I won't be freezing cold. And it's still breathable and airy and cute. And I feel like I could still get a picture out of this. It's some cute little white sandals. I picked up some white sandals from Walmart, you guys. I have the brown ones like this already. So like this swimsuit cover up paired with this. This will be a little cute little outfit. This swimsuit cover up came from Goodwill. It was $4.49, but I got it for half off. And I'm trying to remember where exactly did I find the swimsuit cover ups because I don't think they were in the swim section. 
I want to say this was in either the shirt section or the dress section. I'm not sure. So I got this swimsuit cover up for two dollars and some change, which I'm happy about because, like I said, I can't spend twenty dollars on this. I don't know why. Why, Alexis? I know why, because I want to spend twenty dollars on food. And the next swimsuit cover, you guys, I got is just this simple, basic cotton soft blend black cover up. This is definitely another one that can double up as a cute little beach outfit. So this is where it hits. It hits around mid thigh. It has little bitty slits on the side. And what I love about this swimsuit cover up is it cinches in at the waist on both sides. So you can pull it to tighten it just, you know, to give you a little bit more shape. And on the bottom of the strings are the cute little gold detailing. And I got this swimsuit cover up from Goodwill. That's for 99 cents. Yes, but when I seen that this was 99 cents, I grabbed it. I was like, I don't care if it's too small or too big. Somebody's gonna be using this swimsuit cover up and it fit great. I'll definitely be taking this with me to California because I know it's gonna come in handy and it'll keep me warm for when I go inside the establishments. So yeah, here's this one. All right, you guys, so that is it for this vacation inspired thrift haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. To go out to parties and stand around cause I was too nervous to really get down but my body yearned to be free